Welcome back to the channel, good friends. Brian from Apex Detail. We're about to protect brand new C8 Corvette and use the G Technique Halo Flexible Coating for paint protection film. And we thought we'd take you along for the ride. Halo can be applied over vinyl, any type of PPF, clear gloss, protective film, or even a cosmetic film as well. Let's start this project. We have a brand new C8 Corvette and just getting the track pack. The track pack is protection, the whole front clip, which means the hood, fenders, headlights, bumper, all the trim, uh, trim on the bumper as well, lower rockers, lower doors, and a little bit behind the rear wheels. Let's get the film on the vehicle and let it cure. Then it's time to coat it and protect it with G Technique Halo. After proper and thorough preparation, which means wash, clay, any type of paint correction, we douse the panel we're working on with the slip solution. That's that soapy mixture you see. And we can float the film on that, meaning we can adjust the fitment of the film onto the panel. And when we're happy, we just squeegee out that solution. It's called a slip solution, and it's mostly a surfactant uh, water mix. Next, we do trimming. So a hood like this or a roof or a trunk, we do what they call a bulk installation, which means we just pull it right off the roll, lay it on the panel and cut to fit, wrapping around the edges and the corners. By the way, uh, I now have a new camera, new mic and new editing software. So it's gonna take some time to get this up quickly, get it all together, but I'd like your opinion down in the comment section as to how it sounds and the quality of the video, please. Halo can be applied to and protect vinyl, paint protection film, clear gloss film, or even a cosmetic film, including satin, matte, or different types of colors. We normally give ourselves quarter inch to half an inch to wrap around the edges and tuck underneath the panel. This will give us complete 100% protection and a clean install, not seeing any film lines. From here, we use a tack solution, which is an isopropyl alcohol mix with water to flush out any slip solution or the soapy water. That way we can wrap around the edges and they will stay or adhere to the panel. And there we go, one panel complete. Now we just let it cure or dry out and uh, we move on to the surrounding panels and complete the track pack kit. A complete kit. You get the 30 mil Halo flexible film coating, a pair of nitrile gloves, AP2 ultra soft foam filled applicator, master instruction leaflet, and the window stickers and other goodies. They also sneak two microfiber towels and a panel prep or panel wipe with the kit. Instructions are easy. If you are applying to a previously installed film, not the fresh uh, film uh, install that we're doing here, wash and decon the vehicle first. 
Soak the applicator pad with several drops of the product, prime the pad, and start to spread the product out. Spread onto a small panel or half of a large panel, and then immediately wipe off the residue with the cloths. For best results, uh, two coats is recommended, and let your vehicle inside afterwards for at least 12 hours. The two microfibers are edgeless low nap microfibers. Those are perfect and exactly what I like when removing coatings. Next step, let's grab the panel wipe, spray it onto the panel heavily, remove any residues or anything that can get in between the coating itself and the layer of PPF. Next, grab the 30 mil vial of Halo Open the safety cap and there will be an insert dropper. And be careful that does come out awful quick and awful fast. Spread out the coating onto the panel. A hood this size, you can do half of it. Take your time, do a crisscross pattern to ensure you are spreading out the proper um, product volume on the panel and giving it even coverage. And then from there, grab your microfibers and wipe off. This is what it looks like up close. You'll see it start to sweat and you'll have a little bit of a rainbow effect. Grab one of the two microfiber towels you have within arm's reach and start to wipe off the transfer solution. I just wipe this with this towel lightly and then I'll grab the second towel and buff to perfection. Make sure there's no streaking or high spots whatsoever. The coating is extremely simple and easy to use. Let me give you a first person view and show you. Rather easy to wipe off, unless you're in a hurry and careless, there shouldn't be any high spots whatsoever. That's really all there is to it. Easy to use, great results, very slick as the coating starts to cure and that only increases as time goes on. You want to let it sit at the very least 12 hours 
in your garage or a uh, protected covered area. I'm going to go ahead and give it an 8 out of 10 as a rating on our channel. And I'll put a link down below if you want to look into it further. This has been Brian from Apex Detail. Catch you in the next video.